the Office of the Registrar of Political Parties has rejected the resolutions made during Jubilee Party's National Delegates Conference led by former and retired President Uhuru Kenyatta. Registrar of Political Parties and Derito stated that Uhuru's faction failed to meet the stipulated terms under which she would consider the resolutions passed on May 22nd. In a letter addressed to embattled Jubilee Party Secretary General Jeremiah Kionim, Deritu explained that Jubilee Party's resolutions remains null and void until submission of all unnecess of necessary documents is in place. Kioni delivered the de documents to the office on May 23rd, which was a bit too late. While the, cap the option and windows for accepting Jubilee Party updates were still open, she explained that Uhuru's political wing should consider moving quickly to deal with the mishaps in their documentation. She explained that her office was operating under strict adherence to law and constitution. Anything that did not meet the legal threshold would be rejected immediately. However, the Jubilee Party wing, controlled and led by nominated member of parliament Sabina Shege, held a disciplinary hearing. The former ruling party had been mired by infighting, affecting its operating, seeing the former head of state being ousted as the party's chairman. What do you think about Kioni's blunder made registrar of political parties reject Uhuru's NDC resolutions? And do you think there's someone who's actively working in the government who is having a hand in this? Well, leave your comments down below.